22nd of February 2013, RSPCA Leicester. Now if any of you have been following either my written blogs or the video blogs, you will know that I go to the RSPCA whenever I can, once a week, to spend an hour with their staff and volunteers, teach them how to deal with dogs that they find difficult, dogs that have come to them with specific problems. And rescue centres, as I'm sure you know, are very stressful places for dogs anyway. So it makes it even more important that the people that work in these places have a clear idea of what they're about. Now, what I'm trying to teach them is what they're about is not just looking after the dogs in their care. They've got to get these dogs ready to be able to live in homes again. Because the reason they're in these places is because they haven't been able to live in homes. Okay? Point of in order today from the visit was a German Shepherd. And again, if you follow me and you know what I do, I've got four of my own, so they're a particular favourite of mine. And this female German Shepherd was causing problems and scaring quite a few members of staff because of her perceived aggression towards people. And one of the biggest things I work on with people that work in the rescue centres that I help is that the dog will behave in a very predictable way which is entirely related to how you behave. So this dog expects people to walk up to its kennel, to talk to it, to try and get it out and all the stuff that adds to its stress. And there's a couple of members of staff today who were particularly wary of this dog so we've got to work with them and to show them how to approach the dog in a different way. Because that then means that the dog has to bring you a different set of behaviours. So by changing what you do, the dog recognises that. And then you take the dog into a place where it has no learned behaviour. And then you stay calm and relaxed. And the dog really quickly follows. Because you're not adding to the stress and you're behaving differently. And it was fantastic to watch this very stressed German Shepherd. Relax, calm down, to the point we were able to take her collar, put her in the kennel, bring her out the kennel, do what we wanted reasonably with her, and she was perfectly fine. So it was a very, very powerful lesson for these people today, and one that I hope they apply to every single dog they work with, because that's what will make the difference.